Hi guys, it's Cecily. I had a quick tip I was going to share about uh, food prep and things. Uh, especially when you have a large family and you want to have dinner and be quick and save money. One thing that works out great is buying your meat in bulk, which most of you know. Um, I got, I have a friend who has a Costco membership and I, I'll give her money and she'll pick up a pack of meat for me. Uh, I've got here over seven pounds and it's the 12.88% so it's really lean. Uh, so it's, you know, it was 308 a pound, which isn't the best price I've seen on it, but it's not horrible for the lower fat one. A thing about the lower fat is less of it cooks away. So when you're draining off your grease, you're not draining away half of your money because if you get the higher fat content, which is cheaper, most of it's gonna go down your drain. Another side tip though is when you're packaging it, this came already kind of patted out and it's a little over half pound in each patty, which I like because I don't put a whole pound in a bag. I don't use a whole pound when I cook a meal. Uh, we kind of keep low meat, which is one way we keep our budget down. But, um, it's already patty. So I take the patty Mommy. and I put it in a Ziploc bag. And then, wow. yes, love. I have to go to the bathroom. Okay, give me just a minute, okay? Mm -hmm. All right, I put it in this bag. And I don't leave it in a chunk like this because... That's not going to save me a whole lot of time when I go to frost it. It's <laughs> She's not amused. I take them, squash them down, and just put it in the bag, squash it like this, as flat as you can. I try to make it take up almost the whole bag. So squash, squash, squash. Then seal it up and put it in your freezer. I'll show you what it looks like when it's done. Here's one of my patties. You can see it's pretty thin. It doesn't take up much space. You can easily put it in. It lies flat. Storage it's easier in the freezer. It doesn't take up super amount of space because I don't have a deep freeze currently. I have this little thin thing there and it's kind of awkward to fit anything in that anyway. But I can fit a lot of meat in the bottom of it. And because it's thin, if I forget, oh, I need hamburger for dinner tonight. I needed to thaw that out. If I remember this by 4 o'clock, by 5, if I set it out by 5, it's pretty defrosted. And I'm ready to go. So that saves me time and a lot of money by buying it in bulk, getting the leaner cuts of meat, and storing it thinly. That was really loud. Well, I just want to share that. Now I've got to go wash my hands and help somebody with the potty. You guys have a great day. Bye.